Which is the one that's hard to sleep on? On my right side. Yeah, that's the yeah, one. Yeah. So scoot down towards me. I'm coming in deep into the armpit and then I'm gonna double up underneath and I grab her elbow with my armpit. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. <laughs> so your neck is locked up too. Mm -hmm. Holy cow. Open and close your mouth. This is a little tougher. Yep. <sighs> you did it. Wow. So we have Brandon and Paulina here today. And you're going to definitely do the CFR, right? I am. It's my first time. Okay. Do you have, you said you've had issues before. You had some eye surgery. You've yes. Had, I had um, an eye surgery about a year and a half ago. And I've been feeling some pressure up in this area, up around my brows. So I'm hoping to get some relief. Okay. And you might watch and see if you want to do it. Yes. So we'll leave, leave that for you. Listen outside. You can even hold the camera up there if you can see anything. Like really high and shoot down. But there's a big protest out in the street. And I think it's a big union strike. I'm not sure, but it's loud. <laughs> and this is my life in New York City. What can I say? I, I would never make a video if I waited for a quiet day. It's just never going to happen. So I apologize if it's too loud. But when we go into another room, there'll be loud noises from the other room for different reasons. Okay, so lie on your back. And this is what we're going to do. We're going to hand you Floppy. Floppy was my daughter's growing Aww. up. She's 26 now. Floppy's missing an ear. Floppy happens to be 26 years old too, but floppy's the perfect thing to squeeze, and that gives you something to squeeze when I put the balloon back. Do you have one nostril that's worse than another? Or they, feel, they feel pretty similar. Okay, so the first thing I do is I thread this back in the right side, because that's where I'm going to start. And then once I have it back there, mm -hmm. you're going to take a big breath in where you open your mouth, and then close it. Try it. And then close it, and it's done. Okay. So the, Crawl back on this a little more so your head tilts back. There you go. And there's nothing pleasant about this. You know, we just do it and get it over with. Luckily, I'm very fast at it. Sounds good. So we're going to do the right side. And I just thread this back just like that. Big breath in and hold. Oh, and that was quick. Ooh. What did you hear? I heard some pops. It's definitely pressure at least. Here's... Tissues. Oh, thank you. Do you want to sit up for a minute or do you feel pretty good? I feel okay. Okay. What else did you hear? Like, what type of sounds did you hear? It was sort of like crunchy mm -hmm. and I felt sort of a release going up here, which uh, felt really good. Okay. And my eyes watering. <laughs> yeah, it'll always make your eyes water. So let's try the left side. You ready? I'm ready. Thank you. This is a little tougher. Yep. You did it. You're done. Whew. Now that side might have bled a little bit. Yes. Yeah. So here, sit up and let me take floppy away so you have room. And here I'll explain something a little bit because there's 22 movable bones in the face and the skull. One of the things that the balloon does is it mobilizes the cranial bones. It releases direct pressure on the brain by having your bones squeeze so tight in your face. It relieves the dural men, meningi, um, meningeal tension. And the dura is like the sac or sheath on top of our brain and spinal cord. So it releases some of the pressure around that. And think of the casing on a hot dog being too tight. And we sometimes feel that way where, you know, like our brain and our skull is just too tight. Um, it definitely opens breathing passageways. It will facilitate sinus drainage and some of the people that would come for something like this have breathing problems, migraine headaches, sinusitis, tinnitus, which is the sound in your ears, like the whooshing or ringing, vertigo, Bell's palsy, trigeminal neuralgia, sleep apnea, snoring, head trauma, and um, it helps a whole bunch of different things for people. But we don't really target, we don't really target curing any disease or ailment. Which side was bigger? Um, the right nostril was easier. Mm -hmm. um, I felt about the same release on both of them. Mm -hmm. And um, I guess the left one was tighter. Okay. But you got a good one. All right, good, yeah, good. I, I, Breathe I, now, see what it's like. 
to another one. Yeah, it's easier. Nice full breaths. Okay, cool. Yeah. All right. That's good. Polina. Okay, I'll try. All I'll right. Try so switch yeah, spots. You mind your back. You'll remind me, right? Floppy was good, right? <laughs> yeah. Floppy is great. Yeah. Floppy gives you something to squeeze, and um, you know it's funny because there's a reflex where you didn't have it, but some people will want to reach up and grab my wrist. And then I can't do a fast job mm -hmm. and get it done with. So if you have floppy, the impulse is to hold floppy. You don't grab my wrist. You will tell me when? Yeah. So first I'm going to put this back and do a big breath in and hold. Let me see how you do it. No, big, big, oh. open mouth and then close. No. Yeah, but oh. you hold your breath. So open. That's it. Do it one more time and squeeze your lips tight. So that's wait, it. Wait. You did it. You did it. Do it one more time. That's it. Wait, I don't blow though, right? No, you hold your breath. <laughs> so open your mouth and close and hold your breath. That's it. And it's over. But even if you didn't hold your breath, it works anyway. It's so fast. Okay. So here we go. One? Yeah. Wait a minute. Wait till I set it. Oh, that's tough on you. Wait, let me set it. Okay, now ready? Big breath in and hold your mouth close. Did it. Oh. Here's some tissues. Did you hear any cracking? Yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh. It's like a... Is it funny? <laughs> it's like being underwater. <laughs> yeah, a lot of people say that. <sighs> All right, you ready to do the left one? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right, here we go. Whenever you're ready, big breath in and hold. <laughs> you did it. Wow. You got a tissue, honey? Oh my gosh. Come, come sit up. That one. Is that bigger? Yeah. I can breathe more out of my left one. <laughs> Try to breathe again, see what happens. You're very brave. That was good for you to try today. Does it, does it feel different? Yeah, I'm really more open on the left side. Wow. <laughs> good job, good job. All right, so now we're going to pick it up in the other room. We're going to do a full body adjustment for both of you guys. Ready? Come on with me. So we're back. You're going to go first. You're going to lie face down. And the first thing I'm going to have you do is turn your head all the way to the left where we can see you and drop your shoulder. Now turn all the way to the right and drop your head. Is one way tighter to turn for you? Turning left, turning right. Try it a few times. Left. This one. Now point to where it feels bad. Shoulder. Shoulder. Okay. And that's your bad shoulder, right? No, actually my right one. All right. Is the yeah. yeah. All right, so come sit up for a second. Where's my little chair? All right, and you're going to um, sit here facing them. Okay. Now, you can hear more noises here. I told, told you in the beginning, we have metallic noises, machine noises. What are we gonna do? So, passive range of motion is when the doctor raises your arm, okay? And active is when you raise your own arm. Yeah. So, this is zero degrees. This is approximately 90, and this is 180. And you said this is your worst shoulder, right? Yes, yes or no? Yes. Okay. So I'm gonna passively, so you have to let your arm go. Let me have it. And I'm gonna start picking it up. And I'm holding down our trap. And here it gets a little tight, do you feel it? Yes. So we're really smooth from here. And then what? by the time I get to about 130 degrees, it gets tight, do you agree? Yes. yes. Especially right there. Yeah, it's becoming really numb. Okay. Yeah. Now, I'm going to hold this arm and bring this one up. And it's a little tight here, too. Not as bad. Now, you're actively going to do it, but do it really smooth and investigate your own arm. So instead of just throwing your arm out without thinking, feel the range of motion and you tell me where you feel it start to get tight or slow, okay. or stuck. 
I felt it right in this little yes. range, just yes. in that one little section, and then it goes free again. Yes. But between here and here, it's a little tight. Yes. Yeah. Do you agree? Yes. And you feel it also pulling from yes. underneath. Yes. Absolutely. So that's interesting. That's another spot that it can catch. Is at the bottom of the scapula on the outer lateral edge. It could be the latissimus. It could be the sub scap muscle. Um, and then try it yourself on this side and see where you find the restricted zone. It's kind of in the same area, right? Yeah. Good. Now I'm going to go back one more time to passive, where I lift it. And I'm pur purposely holding her trap so she can't bring it in. And it's stuck in there a little bit. But, but a lot of it's coming from underneath here. Yes. So I'm going to do a few releases on that, okay? Okay. This is a soft, well, it's not that soft, but it's... Okay, can you move your hair off your collarbone? And we're going to start with this collarbone. I'm going to have you lift your chest high. I'm going to pull this collarbone up with my fingertips. And I drive that collarbone up. Then I'm going to come back and I'm going to adjust her scapula from lateral to medial. I bifurcate the uh, spine of scapula and I'm above it and below it. So I'm on the supraspinatus and the infraspinatus, but I'm really contacting the bony structure of the scapula going mostly lateral to medial. And then I also adjust on the base of the humerus and I'm going to do a little radius too. And now I'm going to recheck our work, but actually put your arm over here just for a second. Let's also do here. Good. Now let's recheck it. So, no restriction. You try. Yeah, it's definitely better. Good, let's do the other side. Yeah. Pull that chest up, collarbone up. Nice, right? Oh, yes, that one definitely, for sure. Good difference. So let's yeah. do one more time on this side, okay? okay? And you still have that one there, too. Chest up. So now you're going to lie on your back. There's more. That's just the first level. Okay. There's more, more, more. Okay. And you said the right shoulder's been no. Which is the one that's hard to sleep on? On my right side. Yeah, that's the yeah, one. Yeah, yeah. So scoot down towards me. And you can come close so you don't sure. miss anything, okay? So I'm going to put your hand up here and leave your fingertips right there for me. May I put my hand into your arm? Yes. Into here? Yes. Is that okay? Yes. So I'm going to grab this. I'm holding the. Uh, clavicle with my pinky, I'm coming in deep into the armpit, and then I'm going to double up underneath, and I grab her elbow with my armpit. Oh, wow. And I just set the whole thing. Oh, wow. That's what you needed. Yes. <laughs> oh, yes. Wow. And I feel it in my neck now. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Wow. So come stand and move your arm around so that you feel it. And let us know. Oh, yeah. Definitely a lot of less uh, crunchiness. Feels good. Good. Now come sit here. Okay. And I saw something else that I want to work on. Sit? Yeah. Okay. Thank you. So I'm going to come to the upper right now. I mean upper left. And I'm going to release something up in here by your occiput, okay? Mm-hmm. So I'm going to come under here. And got it. Perfect. Now you also have some compression, so I want to show you. I'll use this arm. So keep your arm firm. Don't let me push. Now watch, if I compress down on your head, your arm goes weak. Hold your arm. Good. So we have to release your compression. So you're going to lie on your back. And 
and I'm going to have you hold the legs as we talked about. Actually, what maybe you get me involved here. So you're going to sit here like this and put your hands up here. So you put her feet behind your armpits. Yeah, and then don't do much, okay? All Just right. know that your body weight's enough, right. and you don't have to do anything more than your body weight. Okay, so lift your head, and this should be easy compared to the nose thing, <laughs> right? Yeah. So big breath in, and blow it out. Then one more big breath in, and blow it out. Oh, wow. What'd oh you feel? wow, all in my neck. Oh my goodness, that was amazing. <laughs> Good. That was great. Now I still have the right neck to do, okay? So I'm gonna lift your head up like this and I'm gonna come deep into the lower cervicals. And I'm even gonna see if I can get a little bit on T1 here, which I feel right there. Oh. Oh wow. Got it. Oh my goodness. Because <laughs> that one goes down the right shoulder. So the brachial plexus um, innervates, it's a bundle of nerves and lymphatics and arteries and veins and nerve supply that feeds this whole trunk, this whole arm. Wow. And now and, I feel it all like yeah. underneath here. Wow. I'm going to do a little bit on this side too because I want to open that shoulder up. Got it. Wow. <laughs> Pretty cool, right? Yeah. Good. Wow. And now we're going to do a little bit down at this end. Oh, wow. I like that. And that was the hip also. Yes! So pull from the hips. That was great. <laughs> yeah. So turn on your side facing me this way, please. I like that. And we're going to do a little more now. Now we're going to open up the lower back. Because remember, you told me when you first arrived, your lower back gets tight? Yes. Big breath in. And blow it out. Oh, wow. Wow. Oh. wow. Oh. Yeah, that was <laughs> good. So turn this way now. Okay. Big breath in and blow it out. <laughs> Those are some big ones, right? Big yeah. full releases. Yes. Now scoot down towards me a little bit. I'm going to reach under. Actually, let's do it this way. Lie face down now. That's very different. <laughs> You're getting there. <laughs> May I lift this part of your shirt sure. up a few inches? Yes. Okay, I'm going to lift it to here. Is that all right? Yes. I'm going to reach in and pull the skin like this. Got it. Okay. Bet no one ever did that before. No. <laughs> I can feel your little bit of scoliosis in the yeah. curve here. Yeah. yeah. Right in there, you get tight, right? Yes. It's a little hard. <laughs> Sorry, sir. Almost done. Good. Wow. <laughs> right on the spot. <laughs> Those are the spots here. Yes. This is a tapping instrument. I'm just going to take these ribs down a little bit. So come stand, move around, see how you feel. What do you think? Yeah. Good. That was good. Let's do a little extra here, okay? Oh, that was something there. Oh, that hurt me. <laughs> You're done. 
Oh my All right, goodness. Good. Okay. Are you ready? I'm ready. All right, your turn, sir. All right, let's go. All right. So you're going to start face up. Okay. So you're going to be on your back. And you can hang out with us. You're going to be right here, okay? All right. So your neck is locked up, too. Mm -hmm. How is your face after the CFR? Are you feeling any I, different? It feels much better. Okay, good. I feel a big uh, pressure release. Okay. And how are you doing in your face? Good. good. You feel this spot right here? Yep. Yeah. Hair pop? Mm-hmm. Scoot down the table a little bit. That was something. <laughs> All right. Did it crack? Makes little little shifts on you. Ooh. Open this jaw a little bit. Your jaws out a little bit. Open up again mm -hmm. and close. Now open all the way. And do you feel how that jaw hurts a little? Yeah, it's tense. Okay. Open up all the way and close. Good. Come sit on this box. Yep. You need something similar that Polina needed. Okay. And you'll face them. Yeah. And then Polina, mm -hmm. come in close so you can see this. Let this fall. Oh. Ooh. Got it. You got it. <laughs> Good. So now line your back again. You can shoot from the top. Open and close your mouth. Now try it. Yeah, feels feels good. Okay. Here we go. We're gonna do a one this way. Holy cow! <laughs> wow. Heard that one, right? Yeah. Oh, Everybody. yeah. Everybody did. Got it. Whew. Scoot down towards me a little bit. Mm -hmm. Little one, did you feel it in the I rib? Felt, yeah, I in did. In the back. in my knee and my ankle. Knee and ankle, good. Line your side facing me this way. Sure. You should take this out of your pocket. Okay. Keys. Oh. Ooh. <laughs> A lot of stuff in there. Wallet. Big breath in and blow it out. That was big. Yeah. Turn this way. All right. Take the Put all that stuff in his pockets. That's my fault. I should tell him. To take <laughs> you should do. I don't know why I forgot. All right. Good. That one's fine. Right. Line your back.
Well, why don't you, why don't you hold these for me? Okay. So put these under your armpits and put your hand up here. So these go on your armpits, and then your hands just clap right there. Okay. Put your weight down. Yeah. So when you pull. You anchor. Oh. That's yeah. It. Okay. And that's enough. It's it's usually the, that's all we need. Big breath in, and blow it out. Ooh. Yeah, that was a big one. Did you feel? I felt it in my neck, in my middle of my back. Yeah. Neck and all the way to the middle of your middle back? Middle of my back, yeah. yeah. Wow. Those are fine. I think I got everything. I'm good. Come sit up and see how you feel. Yeah. Yeah, I feel good. What was your favorite part? That ring dinger at the end, if you want to yeah. call it that. Yeah. The, the pull. Yeah, that was That was thing. huge. I felt it all the way through my neck and down in the middle of my back. And, uh, and that's after we already cracked everything. Yeah. And still, there was still more. Yeah, that was amazing. Yeah. And what was your good. favorite part, Paulina? The white strap, too, and definitely the crack on my shoulder. Yeah. That was amazing. So we'll see what happens with your shoulder, because um, I know it's been bothering you for a long time, right? Yes. Okay. Yes. I'm going to sleep right. on it. All right, we'll see what happens. <laughs> Thank you, everybody. <laughs> and I just set the whole thing. Oh, wow. That's what we needed. Yes. <laughs> oh, yes. One this way. Holy cow. Wow.